Whatever you think you're getting away with. There's nowhere you can run. Nowhere you can hide where we can't find you. Hide? Why? I'm Commander Shepard. I never hide. I've made some progress. Would you like me to call the meeting? Do it. We have a lead. I called in some favors to run a trace on the gun. It led me to a casino owner named Elijah Khan. He's been suspected of using his profits to smuggle weapons onto the Citadel. Immediately after the attempt on Shepard's life, Khan made an interesting call. I'm cutting you off. I'm returning your down payment now. What's the problem? Turn on a vid screen. When I sell a gun, I don't want it showing up on the nightly news. You won't be linked to me. Save it. Our association is terminated. And if you even think of coming after me, I've got info on you ready for prime time. So you ponder that. Con out. So that's our identity thief. Looks like he's got an ID disguiser. Those things are a pain in the ass to get around. Khan didn't sound friendly to whoever that voice was. Maybe he'd pass on that info to us. That would take some extremely smooth talking. If he sees you, he'll probably assume you're looking for revenge. The casino has a panic room. Chances are he'll have gone to ground there. Edie can give us programs to hack the door, but the cameras and guards complicate things. Yeah. Khan could disappear. Or worse. If his guards ever open fire, normal people could get hit. I did. She's right. We can't risk spooking him. We go in quiet. Small team. No gunplay. Dr. Tassoni, this evening the casino will be hosting a charity event to assist war refugees. Purchase some tickets, Glyph. Then call up a layout of the building. Score! So, how close can you get? You don't usually put a back door in a panic room. This air shaft bypasses the security gate and ends up in storage. From there, the panic room's door camera can be disabled. Uh, too convenient. There's gonna be alarms all over that shaft. I believe I have some countermeasures that may help. I'll know more once we're inside. Who will go in this shaft? They need to be small in size. My presence in the casino would arouse suspicion. Mechs are not allowed, since they can have cheating software. What you need is somebody trained in zero emissions tech. No electronics, no metal, just undetectable polymers. We had a chorus back at Op End, disabling a bomb with these little tweezers. See, the bomb was filled with shaving cream. All right. You're in. What? No! What? You said it yourself. We've all got too much tech. But... <laughs> I managed to get shot just coming to talk to you. Now I'm supposed to hack my way into a safe room? We'll be backing you up. The second you hit something you can't handle, we'll cover you. If that's settled, it looks like there's one last hurdle to get us inside. Which is? Black tie required. Looking good, Commander. Lean and mean. You know what they say about a sharp-dressed man. Oh, that reminds me. You were packing an Omni-Blade. Tag on the inside of this dress is gonna kill me. I'll get to the ventilation shaft. Wish me luck. 
Liara, you have any input? I'm here, Shepard. Edie and I will keep in contact in case we're needed. Khan has a lot of surveillance set up. I'd mingle with the guests if you want to look normal. Okay, Ash. Time to meet the riffraff. What do you have? Nothing too crazy. I want to be able to walk a straight line. Testing tempo coming up. Are Asari drinks usually mild? Not all of them. Mr. Khan had us put out some gelatin shots earlier. Also Asari, they kick like a shotgun. Evening, officer. Sir. Why, hello, love. Isn't the turnout amazing? I wasn't sure anyone would show up. We pull together when we have to. I feel so bad for the humans. If you need a place to stay or anything, you just let me know. I have a place to stay now, but thanks. So you had nothing before that? Oh, how brave of you to endure, dear. The humans are so resilient. Like that phrase of theirs, stiff one in the lips. Stiff upper lip. Right, of course. What did I say? Commander, I'm upstairs by the grate leading to the shaft. But there's a problem. Can you meet me? Okay, right. Just like we thought. There's an alarm on the grate. We'll have to bypass it. Dr. Tassoni gave me this to pass to you. It's a resonance emitter lens. It should let you see security grids and wiring. Good. I'll follow the wiring to a junction box, splice it, and disable the alarm. Yeah. Fingers crossed. The lens is working. Good. Follow the blue wiring. In case it needs to be said, don't try to bypass a camera while you're being watched. You know, I respect the first guy who lived up at Saturn. Khan, I'm not here to threaten you. We need to talk. What the hell? Can just anybody walk in here? I don't feel so special now. Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Damn it. Everything's been wiped. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... <gasps> when I tripped that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Thought so. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Oh, so we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Elijah, come crawling back. Guess again. You, I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like a fish. You'll need to do better than that. The last guy to trash talk me was a few kilometers taller than you. Brave. I thought as much, but it won't matter. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. Why do this? What did I do to you? I'm gonna take everything you have, and everything you are. Damn it. <sighs> Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the data drives. The ones that got wiped? You think we can find something? With Edie, anything's possible. The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. Hell of a party. Too bad the host died. It wasn't a total loss. Brooks, work with Edie to see if there's anything useful on those drives. Here's hoping. I'll let you know what we find, Commander. <laughs> Damn, Commander. He can't even attend a party without someone ending up dead. Now, if I can just find some chow around here, you'd think a pad like this would be stocked. I am glad to see my physical proximity was not necessary to the success of the mission, Shepard. Let's see what you find before we call it a win.
could go for some food while we wait. Too bad you shot the hell out of the best sushi place in the Citadel, huh? Fancy party? Check. Super sexy outfit? Check. Fights crime? Check. Well, almost. We got close. Damn close. I hear it was quite the party, even if things didn't go exactly as planned. At least you didn't come away empty-handed. Greetings, Commander. Sounds like the mission ended with a hiccup. Well, I'm just glad our team made it back okay. I think we've got something, Commander. Commander, Edie and I have been analyzing those drives. I think we found something if you're ready. Let's hear it. Though the data's root structure was erased, the logic integrity remains viable. Edie has an incredible talent for this stuff. I know she's an AI, but even still. We found an encrypted communication from a few days ago. Just need another minute to crack it. A whole minute? Edie here could shave that down to five seconds. I thought it best to allow staff analyst Brooks a chance to improve her decryption skills. And now you've lost your chance to show off. Like she needs it. You're the crew of the Normandy. You're legends to the rest of the Alliance. It's all just part of the job. Wait. Job? You mean the rest of you are getting paid for this? Here we go. Wow. Those marks who were after you, they bought a lot of weapons. Like, big ones. Max? What do they need that kind of firepower for? It appears this drone is preparing to rebel. I have just monitored the Commander's Spectre access code in use at the Citadel Archives. Punch it up. The Archives are going into emergency lockdown. Where's hacking your records is there right now? What do we know about the place? Council keeps sensitive historical information there. Real hush-hush. Even my old CSEC clearance never got me in. Then we'll find our own way in. Gear up and let's... What's with the Volas? Oh, pizza delivery guy. I got the munchies. <sighs> Double pepperoni. These archives are huge. You'll have a lot of ground to cover. Shame you can't bring everyone. Who says we can't? All hands on deck for this one. Hell yeah, but uh, who gets to take point with you? <coughs> <coughs> Who's going to pay the bill? is located below the wards. Maybe a direct breach for maximum surprise? I like it. Sounds like you're learning the ropes. Hell, hang out with us long enough and you'll learn ropes, knives, bombs, thresher moths. You forgot homicidal synthetics rebelling against their masters. That was a joke, right? The archives are somewhere below us. It could be pretty tricky to get in there. Not really. I take it the subtle approach is out. Take 
okay? Drop your weapon, so this won't end well for her. You bastard! All right. <laughs> Whatever you think you're getting away with, there's nowhere you can run, nowhere you can hide, where we can't find you. Hide? Why? I'm Commander Shepard. I never hide. Is this cycle always so strange? Who are you? You weren't the only Shepard that Cerberus brought back to life. But at least one of us will finally do something with it. If you're really me, then we're on the same team. Hardly. I was created for spare parts, in case you needed another arm, or a heart, or a lung. A clone? Did the elusive man send you? No. He abandoned me when he had what he wanted. You. Then why try to kill us? Because I don't have his memories. I'd never fool my supposed friends. The ones who abandoned their duty to join the cult of Shepard. Like you, Garrus Vicarian. You're nothing more than a burnt-out cop past his prime. And you're just a pale imitation of the real thing. I'm the real thing perfected. I'm you without the wear and tear, Shepard. The doubts, failures. I'm the lone wolf you were always meant to be. Without the emotional baggage holding me back. No one would ever believe you're the commander. They will when I'm flying his ship. This is Shepard. Initiate Normandy lockdown. Transmitting command codes now. Good idea. Too bad the signal was blocked. Trainer, this is Shepard. Prep the Normandy for emergency departure. We're leaving. I'm sending the command codes now. Acknowledged. We'll get underway. It'll be a cold day in hell before someone steals my ship. It's not stealing if I'm you. Execute them. The Cult of Shepard ends today. We still got everyone?
Pushing into the archives. Stay in your groups. Team Mako, you're on point. Right. What's a Mako? Something we could use right about now. Team Hammerhead, cover the flank. Got it. And the Mako's got nothing on the Hammerhead. At this point, anything's possible. Like waking up and finding out you have a clone? I don't want to talk about it. At least not until everyone has ingested alcohol. So how will we find anything in here? Glyph! Yes, Commander? Track the target. Give me updates on its location. What is the nature of the target? He looks like me. Then I have found the target. No, Glyph. It's another me. Now get going. At once, Commander. is searching for something 200 meters ahead. Got it. Fighting your own clone. Pretty crazy, even by our standards. Useful, though. Anything you don't want to do, Shepard? Let them handle it. So, like a personal butler? I don't want to talk...
That's the moment when the universe ran out of ammunition. The other me can't be far. Keep up the pressure and we'll try to surround him. Let's move. <laughs> 